I don't offer predictions, I deliver spoilers. About a year's time ago, a day before the launch of Pathan State announcement, I predicted that Pathan will not only be a hit film, but one that will bring back the true Indian cinema experience post-COVID. Now, as of this moment, what matters the most is the coming back of cinema into people's hearts. And nobody can do that better than one of the most popular actors globally. There's still a lot of time, SRK, to make great films, but we have to start with good ones, which is what you're doing, which is what I'm happy about, the formula that will work. And with this idea, let's enter the summer, guys. The summer of Pathan. And what happened? For all the speculation the world had about Pathan and even all the double-sided critics who were first on the bandwagon of SRK being a flop actor have now changed back to SRK being the king. You must be wondering how was I so sure about Pathan being a blockbuster? Not even a blockbuster, officially the biggest film of Hindi cinema, right? Well, I must begin by saying it's not surprising to see that people have gone back to loving SRK awesome, bigger wala hai. as they once did and have newfound respect for his courageousness. The sun came in that day when Shah Rukh walked in on sets. And perhaps this is where the source of my confidence lied as well. Courageousness. Because, to be honest, there are many a times when I thought that maybe the forces against SRK are too strong to subdue through any kind of campaign or a film marketing strategy. I thought, just once or twice however, that Pathan might not do as well as I thought it should. But I'd probably forgotten that SRK is a marketing genius. He did what no one expected. Instead of promoting the film like crazy, because he should because it's his comeback film after 5 years, the entire team of Pathan talked straight to the audience, to their fans, and no one else. No media, no promotions, nothing. The fans, and that's it. And you know what? The success of Pathan has taught me three things. First is to believe in yourself and no one else does. It sums up what kind of trial SRK went through and how he came out of it not only winning, but winning the world. That brings me to my second lesson. Always love. Like that Nara Surf song, it's true and SRK has shown us. First to the audience, second to all the people in media for supporting the film so much in spite of the fact that there might have been things that could have curtailed the happy release of this film. I just want to say there's so much love from all sides and we can never show enough gratefulness. Not only us, the whole film industry, what is rightly or wrongly called Bollywood or the Indian film industry. I think we thank you on behalf of all, all our colleagues and friends in the film industry for bringing life back to cinemas. Regardless of whatever was happening, whatever people said about all this, SRK turned his haters into his fans by simply focusing on giving out love. He focuses on the positive and tries to deliver on the criticism. And that's the third thing I took away from this. The third and the last thing is how I will treat every situation as well. I just want to be in direct communication with the people who watch this channel and nothing else, no one else. I make this content for you. For you to watch. And if you're not happy with it, then I'm not. No longer will I ever stick to my own thought of making something good and it's just not getting its recognition. I need to earn my recognition. And so I will. The thing about the success of Pathan is that the hype for this film was never mild to begin with. And it grew in such a manner that by the end, it was either going to be the biggest flop of all time or the biggest hit of all time. And I had a strong inclination that Shah Rukh Khan has such a strong fan base that people will write down to hell in order to see this man succeed because he represents something. Millions, billions of people are like this, who love me. So when I am sad, I will come to my balcony. When I am sad, I will come to my balcony. The fact is that God has made me so much that God has made me so much. कि मुझे हमेशा उसने हमेशा के लिए बैलकनी का टिकट दिया हुआ है समथिंग मोर समथिंग मोर देन एन एक्ट 
This film represented something more than a film. It was no longer a film. It was an event. An event in contemporary socio-cultural times. And I know I'm being really vague here, but that's exactly what I'm trying to avoid. Positivity and love is what we need in this world, especially now. And SRK proved that it still exists. The phenomenon of good hearts, good people. For me, and I've always said this, SRK has always been great because of his personality. It's not easy to be who he is, how he has become with the amount of obstacles he had in his life. He's not a movie actor who inspires me. To me, he's a businessman, a marketing genius, a family man, an intelligent human, a witty joker, a fun-loving kid in a man's body, and a true star as well. And so I guess now that all records have been broken, bridges have been demolished, I will take this moment to announce the new mini-series coming to this channel, which will take you back to the beginning of SRK's career. I'm really excited to announce this. Fauji, the Shara Khan debut. And with that, I'll take your leave. Bask in the sunshine of Pathan and keep watching MDR because Aram.